All right, Montreal. Kale Flurry there. Okay, so all the insiders have been correct so far. Lozon, Borgen, Chalowski, Dreger, and now Flurry. We will most likely see Hayden Flurry, Kale's brother, be taken from the Anaheim Ducks later in the draft as well. But. They didn't take price, dude. They didn't take price. Ross, thank you for your subscription here. I could totally understand why they didn't take price. It was too expensive. It's too risky. They really considered it. But Flurry, at the end of the day, is a young right-handed defenseman who's got some really good potential, man. I've been a really big fan of Flurry for a long time. And seeing him not be in the Habs anymore, it does kind of sting. But hey, the Habs still do have some other right-handed defensemen that they do have value in. Ugly Potato, thank you so much for your subscription here. Mark Bergevin's bet, though, it paid off. It paid off. They put the protection spot for Allen. Nick, thank you for your subscription here. They protected Allen. They exposed Price. They exposed Weber. And they lost Kale Flurry. So it's fantastic that Montreal was able to get that pulled off. Devo as well. Thank you for your subscription here. But Kale Flurry, man, playing with his brother, most likely. It's going to be really nice to see that pairing come to life in Seattle. I know here in Vancouver, I'm going to be paying attention to him and his career over there. Um, Alicate as well, thank you for your subscription here. But for Kale Fleury, man, this could be a pretty good opportunity. I mean, we noted this before, but the Seattle Kraken, according to all the leaks, they don't seem to have too many right-handed defensemen. A lot of these guys are lefties, so for Kale Fleury, I think he's coming into a new organization where he is going to be seen as one of the more accessible guys in the lineup. You know, you're not playing behind Petrie, you're not playing behind Weber, you're not playing behind freaking Gustafson. Hey, Macklemore is there. I didn't recognize him with the longer hair. That is awesome. But Kale Fleury, man... If this guy becomes a good top four defenseman in the long-term future, I would not be surprised. So good for him. Montreal, their bet paid off. And Flurry's going to Seattle. Carey Price is staying around, baby. Jake Allen's still back here as well. It's good that they did that bet because Price was like, yeah, you know, if, if I'm going to be out for a part of the season and you guys lose out on Allen because you don't protect me or you don't protect him, that's going to be really bad. Oh, Joey Decord goes from the Ottawa Senators, so there's another pick that's correct. Looks like all the insiders were correct about this draft here. Um, Brandon, thank you for your subscription as well. But yeah, just finishing up my thoughts on Kale Fleury. He's going to be good. I think he's got good potential. Montreal, they came away like bandits here on this one. And Seattle's taking Fleury.